Okay, what's up guys? This is Elfie here and today we're gonna be talking about the rise and fall of myself, yes. So my career as a content creator started in 2017 back when I used to do YouTube. I would like make dance videos and stuff with my cousins. Some cringe ass shit if you know what I mean so yeah. Then I stopped doing YouTube in about 2018 I think. Like I stopped doing the cringe videos them I used to do with my cousins and in 2019 I began no it was 2018. I began playing Free Fire but I didn't have my own phone so I used to play it on my cousins right and in 2019 now oh, I got my phone and I built my account and started playing professionally that's when I started creating Free Fire content but before I started doing Free Fire I used to do like comedy skits and so in 2019 and I used to make songs cause I'm a songwriter, actor, author, filmmaker you name it and gamer so my career mainly began in 2019 but in 2020 i uploaded my first video on tiktok it was a failed trend but i then uploaded my first viral video um foods jamaican men put why on and after it went viral i like i took up the sauce on thing like instant if you're og you probably know me as the smile face killer but most people know me as the sauce hunter or the free fire up god even though I start making songs But it bug came as a fashion Turn it to ashes Turn a sassy up like satis Bo explode No we bombing Oh my head Like in my field Bucky mo dispazzy I need a bo barrel Fine anyway Get out of here fine Oh my head blood splash like sorry Make bo run Like burial allen fi No say We beat and teach be a evil pre No friendship keep prang Chapel up like me Tell me don't waste breath Just me gun them speak Sniper Take where your head well clean Free that You know Officer please One shot and boy start creep If I want to love the pastors Come check me So yeah where did I fall off now? I was mostly known for my hit series Walking the Ogre, Pro Free Firefish. What do you mean by a girlfriend you want to body up with? Oh, fuck yeah, enjoy this! Sauce Hunting. Shop now, right? And Pro Free Fire Demonic. There are even cases of people being pulled down and hit the earth. And not to mention headshotting info like. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah. <laughs> Those jumps started my career, then I started to go into editing and I took the free fire thing like very seriously. I have about 400 plus videos on TikTok right now. <sighs> like I used to upload every day back then. But now I have to be studying for exams and I have CXC coming up and SVAs and shit so yeah I barely get time to do anything. And the main reason why I'm not motivated to do anything is because when I post nowadays it's like 100 views to 500 views I don't get 1k again So where did I fall off? The influencer program Yes I was obsessed about the program 2 years ago And you know me I don't wanna go in for the free stuff I just merely want to be an inspiration to this generation of free fire players Like I really wanted it But now I've come to the conclusion that I will never get influenced, I like, let's just face it, so, after being obsessed with it for 2 years now, I just finally give up. So it all started in 2021, right? This is not the influencer program, this is the partner program, but I didn't know any better, but, yeah, so, after I tried out for that and it got closed, I don't even know why I was upset, because I didn't even meet the requirements, so, yeah. Actually, I didn't even know what I was thinking because um, the partner program is for like big heads like Vincent and Zombie, them people with like over 100,000 subscribers or so. But the influencer program now, yes. So for the first time I applied in 2021, still didn't meet the requirements and the program got shut down anyway. So yeah, after that, I just got obsessed about the program. Like, I didn't think I could be making content just freely so I like without no compensation or nothing so yeah just get obsessed with the program 
and over a year me just see it pop up somewhere I think it was TikTok I don't remember how I found it um supposed to Brandon um he got in the program and I asked him and he directed me to Zombies Discord and in that moment bro like I knew what was up so many people wanted to apply for the program and after not hearing about it for a year like I was so psyched so the program took months out of me first when I joined um I didn't think that I would meet the requirements but they dropped the requirements low to a thousand and I was kinda mad at first because when I applied in 2021 it was 10,000 and now that I've met it bro they've dropped it way down to a thousand like come on bro but still I was psyched because I knew that I definitely could make it in now I can't remember um, some of the rules that they said um, to join the program because the discard is now um, deleted by zombie so basically followers didn't really matter again it's just basically likes and exposure so I wasn't worried because like 50% of the Free Fire Jamaican population know me like I have a pretty good fan base and I mostly speak English because I rap in English used to and even though bro I'm still speaking in English because I practice it so much that it became a norm for me so yeah I was basically past eligible this time I did everything they wanted me to. I complied and followed every rule and regulation. I joined the discard in August and now it's November and I still don't get influencer. The first step was to DM this bot called Mob and just send a link and them will check it. I send my socials and I think it took months, I don't remember, or weeks to get a reply and I only got a bot reply. I think I ended up getting a human reply a few weeks after or so like i said the influencer program is just a whole ass process bro i was psyched more than some of these content creators because they don't know how long i've been chasing this and how hard i work in trying to get influencer this is the closest i've ever came to get influencer because the last application was just a farm on google but now you're actually accompanied by real people and so yeah i was feeling very optimistic so after being jolly for days they finally added the um recommend me section you basically had to send in your links and why you wanted to be influencer you know me now of course me got all out bro me now my application stay like this <coughs> so the same morning when recommend me up mob I had the first one for sending me link. Oh, fuck yeah, joke this. You feel a joke, me dear? Tell me, I'm obsessed with the program, bro. I sang in a class the day and me dear had the homework, and then I see Zombie say she got to recommend me in a couple of minutes. I sit down and I tell you, wrote a whole ass essay why I want to become an influencer. Yeah, so after that play out and I get recommended for my stream, I had the first one for sending me link, so I did the first one for get recommended. So. I think me would have been the first one to get influencer although I don't think nobody found the list to get influencer because the program just basically shut down right now and I was sad at first but I just life bro but I spend so much time and money for so much years and still not get it like it just upset me I don't know if you can hear me because I'm vicing over in the rain that's how committed I am but yeah, the influencer program basically destroyed my life, bro. Like, my whole career, everything I ever worked for go down in flames because of the influencer program. If me never so stupid and just betrayed my fans, them just forget sweets. And you know, I'm not going to feed sweets. I just basically just always I, I call it so. I stop so soon, I stop making proof free fire fish, and I stop doing every normal thing healthy would I do. All because me achieved some dead dream. My videos them normally is over 10k and the last video I have will go over 10k. I post that in a August so that for sure you say the day I start chasing influencer that I day I fall off. I change my freaking content, I become a completely different person. And look where that get me now. Nowhere. I'm surprised people even still remember my brother because some people at my school like them surprised when them say are the real sus hunter and me like what bro cause me fall off how people still remember me me basically irrelevant right now me used to get thousands of views on youtube now me just i get be a cash pot number 
Since my apply for influencer, I did there 16.3k. Now I did at 16,173. And every day they drop like what not. Oh! I literally 10 minutes I did talk for that. Feel like one of them podcast sneakers. But anyways, more of the story, um, I always do what I love because if I didn't get an influencer program, I basically would have to change up my content. Now I go back to my old ways and I make proof for fire fish and them things, then nobody can tell me what to do. But yeah, so you learn something today. I don't think I can recover from the fall off there, but I go still post free fire content. But now, what I do is try to learn how to make money and them things then. Basically, self improve and doing creative things. I gone back to music and writing songs after not making a song from about grade 7. I lie, I did make a song in a grade 9 but it did flop. My phone mic never good and I figure up the editing process. So yeah, this is the end of the video. Thank you for watching. You may like nobody watch this but I'm a shot button for months now. Yeah man, bye.